My name is Matthew Allison, and this is my Global Issues Project. I did my project on Africa, the second largest continent in the entire world. Specifically, the country Burundi. It is located in the mid-east of Africa. The issue in the country of Burundi is hunger. It has the highest percentage of starvation in the world. Hunger is a feeling of discomfort or weakness caused by the lack of food coupled with the desire to eat. It is a very sad thing to see. People in Burundi will go for days at a time without having a single meal. Thousands of people have already died from this issue. You can see the pain in all of their eyes. It is definitely a problem that needs to be taken care of as soon as possible. We will now learn about the causes of this terrible trouble in Burundi. One of the main causes of hunger in Burundi is the Civil War. It started in 1993 due to conflict between the Hutus and Tutsis. It ended in 2006 with a result in 300,000 deaths. This left a major mark on the country and caused many problems to stay. Another problem is the outrageous weather that caused horrible flooding. This led to 3,000 people losing their homes and many crops were destroyed. The first perspective on this issue is Jean Dominic Masabuka, a nurse in Burundi. He once said, it's visible, you can see it, and even see that they have no strength. You can see it in their face that they have not had enough to eat. He believes that the ethnic groups need to end conflict so they can help provide food for each other. Matthias Baruku, a 50-year-old man in Burundi, said the wage of $1.25 was a fortune compared to others in Burundi. 90 to 95 percent of people in Burundi live on less than $2 a day. Matthias believes that more jobs need to be available with higher pay so that they can buy food for them and their families. There are many solutions created that help Burundi receive the food that is needed. The World Food Program is helping by providing school meals to the school children. They also help by holding nutrition activities for children aged 6 to 23 months old. And lastly, they help by providing emergency food assistance when needed. These solutions do help fix the problem, but there are still many barriers. One problem is the great distances between the countries that can help Burundi. The last barrier is the rate of food produced in the country. It's not enough to meet the needs of all the people. These solutions and barriers show that there are many ways to bring a country up, yet multiple ways to bring them down too. We all know that hunger is not a good thing. We need to put our part out there by doing whatever we can. I believe that if large amount of countries come together, we can stop the problem. All we need to do is provide Burundi with the food and resources that they need to bring them back to their feet. Thank you for taking your time to watch this video. I really hope you learned from it and will not take for granted the food that is available to you.